So what is up everyone this is Kiran here welcome back to Tech Kiran YouTube channel as i previously mentioned you about android version 12 i installed the developer preview on my redmi note 9 pro and redmi note 8 both of the devices that i already shared with my experiences but on xda we just saw there are some upcoming features which are coming in android version 12 which i'm going to discuss with you in this video stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end it's gonna really interesting one the features which i'm going to share with you are quite interesting i'll try to link in the description for this article so you can go and check it out it has some functional changes it has some design changes it has some privacy features it includes a lot of improvements it has very interesting customization options available in android version 12 and after checking out these features you will definitely love android version 12 and you will be excited for the upcoming android 12 update for your device if you get as we have installed a developer preview that didn't include a lot of features of course developer preview but in upcoming builds we have this option let me share with you the video which we have this is the scrolling screenshot related customizations this is how it will just work now and as you can see it has very new kind of ui and it looks actually quite good let me just show you once again we've just enabled this just click the screenshot if you want to choose a scroll screenshot there's a new option new ui to choose the scrolling screenshot option we have the app pairs related options available and what is this basically you simply can use the full screen indicator even in the split screen so it looks actually quite good the multitasking seems to be better now you can simply switch between both of these tabs it looks quite good and it's very interesting feature in android version 12 which i also love that a lot we also include some other options where you can see this kind of screen here like that we have the hold power button for assistant this is a very interesting feature you simply need to hold the power button to simply enable the assistant on your device this is a screenshot which i have shared with you right now as you can see trigger the assistant by holding the power button and this looks actually quite good it also includes the device control search bar and the widget picker you can see all those screenshots are listed on the xda website all the pics all the article credit goes to the xda i just saw all these things and that's why i just wanted to let you know we also use the new emojis and if you don't know i already made a video that how you can get these emojis right now on your android version 11 or maybe android version 10 also with just kind of a magisk module we have the new wi-fi interface and i just love this interface let me just show this is the interface which you're getting here and this interface looks quite better if you compare it with the previous previous interface this looks quite good this is why i just love this thing a lot on my device let me share with you some other things and this is the ui you're getting in the control center or quick settings not sure very soon but maybe with the stable build not sure but it looks actually quite good we also have the new kind of volume panel ui this is the volume panel ui which you're getting here it looks quite good we have the new splash skin this is the thing which you're getting here you can see some animations are changed here you will see you'll notice some things after using these on your device let me just show you once again this is to see this clearly it looks actually quite good like that we also have the ripple and over scroll effects and this this is the thing which i personally like a lot just see this this is how it's looking and yes i was just looking for this thing and i we finally got this app drawer opening animation this is how your app drawer opening animation should look like every feature in the upcoming update would be one of the great ones i just saw this update here and maybe it looks good even it also includes the new kind of charging animation just watch this this is how you're getting the new charging animation it looks good it's it definitely looks good this is a thing which you should be looking for i am also looking for and i'm pretty excited to install this thing on my device you can see new kind of brightness slider here but brightness slider i didn't like that honestly extra dim option is available this is the new name for the brightness related settings basically so these are the things you're getting in this latest standard version 12 maybe very soon in the upcoming updates not sure about this right now we also have the clipboard access rated things but this was available in some custom rooms already this is you can see chrome pasted text you copied it was a thing which was already present in some custom rooms based on android version 11 
but maybe it will it will come with the stock android version 12 so this might be a very good thing also other things you already i already shown you enhanced notification permissions better location related permission let me show you this is the thing which i yes this is very great allow home to access the device precise location or approximate location it looks good it is far better than if you compare it with the android version 11 related settings all the things you already saw this is all thanks for watching goodbye over the edge feel like i'm floating through the air